Can you hear me? Yes, yes sir. Okay. Well, um, today we're going to watch the oral projects in the first part of the class. And in the second part, you're going to do the, the written exam on Helbling. I'm going to open the exam on Helbling, and then you will have around 40 minutes to complete it, okay? But that is going to be the second part of the class, okay? One moment, please. I'm going to project the videos.
I must fix it. Well, um, I'm going to show the some pictures that represent the places or the objects of my house that need be fixed. Be fixed, fix it. Uh, the first problem to fix in my house is the the mosquito units. Do the moisture and the water, the wooden to frame the wooden frame roots. So my father is having to create a new mosquito units. Mm. Another problem that exists in my house is in the roof. Due to the climate, the humidity, the salt in the environment, and the quality of the materials, and the roof is the roof begins to pitch from the plaster. And that causes fissures and cracks in the roof. But the main cause, cause of the fall the plaster is because the the tile is the tile is not the, the roof is not waterproof. Um, well, my father is having to fix the roof waterproof waterproofing proofing it and plastering the roof. That's, that picture is an example. Well, that's is other example. <laughs> um, the last problem that exists in my house is when it rains, the water enters to throw the large windows that exist um, to solve it. My forehead is having to blow to roofs. Uh, well, uh, this will be the places to fix in my house. Well, I thank you for your attention and watch this video. Okay, Abner, you described the problems very well, but you didn't use the structure that, that was required. I asked you specifically to use the, the grammar structure have or getting something done. Why? Because when you have something done or get something done, you hire somebody else. You hire a construction worker and an electrician, um, a plumber, etc. because you cannot do it. You don't know how to do it. And if you know, well, you imagine you cannot do it because the purpose of the activity was to use the structure, okay? That is my main correction. Let's continue.
aparición. I live in an apartment which has a A living room, a bathroom, a kitchen, a bedroom, and a wall. Today, I am going to tell you uh, about things that have been done at home, and um, which need to be fixed. Fixed, and I will show the maze properly. We adapt uh, the world. Alexis Rafael Aparicio Hernández. I live in an apartment which has a living room, a bathroom, a kitchen, a bedroom, and a workroom. Today I am going to tell you uh, about things that have been done at home and um, which need to be set, fixed and I will show the maze properly. We adapt a uh, the workroom to a bedroom. Two years ago, my parents had their kitchen painted. No, the kitchen floor is cracked, so I'm having my parents fi fix the kitchen floor. Another situation is the door of the bathroom is hard to open, so I am having my brother oil jingles. In another case, one wall in my living room is scratched. So I am having my that fixed that wall. Okay. Uh, one wall in my bedroom has holes in it because they drilled to put things that were there before. So I am getting someone filed the holes in the wall. My windows are very dirty because I, I hardly wash them. So I am having my brother wash the windows. My neighbor has some plants in his balcony that he waters every week. The thing is that since he's been doing that for quite some time, now some mold has started to grow. So he's getting the mold removed. My downstairs neighbor has dry root because she let her foot run down to the drain. So she's having a plumber fixed to the drain. My upstairs neighbor gets water through her roof because she owns dried it. So she's having a wheelchair covered the hole. The roof of the apartment building is dangerous because it has no railings. So my neighbors are having a blacksmith put railings. My neighborhood street has potholes. So everyone in the neighborhood are having someone fix the street. Um, that is all the construction problems that I have encountered in my house and the neighborhood. Uh, thank you very much for your attention and goodbye. Yes, teacher.
Well, I live in a very small room. That's all I need for myself. I live alone. Nevertheless, it has some serious problems. I'm putting some pictures of the things that I need to repair. So you can have a better idea of my problems. First of all, this is the main door. The main door has the glass broken, as you can see. The problem with this is that it lets all the mosquitoes in at night and it's very annoying. So I'm getting the glass repaired the next week. I have already called the specialist for this job. I think it's called Glacier. Next is my kitchen. In this kitchen window are missing some glass pieces. Sometimes the neighbor's cat getting through these small spaces. So I'm getting the kitchen window fixed the next week too. With the same glass specialist, specialist that is going to repair the glass from my door. Now in my living room, I have no bulb socket, so I have no light in the nuts. I'm having this repair later when I get some money because it's not very important because the light from my kitchen lightens very well all my room. Also, I have this fan ceiling that is broken from all its blades. So I'm having the fan ceiling replaced maybe the next week. I don't know who I need to call for this job, but I will research it later. And the last thing that I need to repair is my bathroom sink. I don't have one, so I'm having my sink bite for the last because it's very expensive. And I'm getting the sink placed by a house builder because I don't know how to place it. That are all things that I need to repair or fix in my house. As you can see, there are a few things because I live in a small room, but some of them are expensive. Well, that's all. And thank you for your attention and see you next time. And I'm going to talk about some things that need to be done in my house and in my neighborhood. Like in my kitchen, where we need to put roof waterproofing because when it rains, Also, we need to get repaired the microwave or maybe get some one new because it explodes the lights the last week. And we need to get the house painted because it has not been painted for like three years. And we need to get the some electrical wiring repair because it's dangerous. 
and some cracks of concrete of the concrete concrete wall need to get repaired. And in my neighborhood, there are a lot of problems like potholes in the streets that need to be repaired. There are also several trees that need to be collected since the hurricane and that happened the last year. And the neighborhood park needs some maintenance. Uh, well, this is the all of the presentation. Thank you all for paying attention. Have a good day, everyone. I will talk about the things that need to be repaired in my house. The purpose of this video is to use what was seen in class to explain things that need to be repaired at home or in your neighborhood. The first thing is the air conditioner. The air conditioner is working but it's a little bit dirty. So I get into air conditioner cleaning, the kitchen tap. Hi everyone, my name is Daniel. Hi everyone, my name is Daniel Hernandez Hernandez and I will talk about the things that need to be repaired in my house. The purpose of this video is to use what I was seen in class to explain things that need to be repaired at home or in your neighborhood. The first thing is the air conditioner. The air conditioner is working, but it's a little bit dirty. So I get into air conditioner cleaning. The kitchen tap is leaking. It doesn't work. Um, I get in this tap changing. Top of the patio is useless and doesn't work. So I have the tap changing. A kitchen contact is working but it's misplaced so I'm getting it fixed. The shower is not working properly, it's a little bit obstructing and I'm getting it changing. The main gate cannot be opened easily, it's, it's so hard so i having to put it oil. The light in my room has burned out, I'm getting the light changed. A piece of kitchen tile is, is broken so I'm getting it repairing. My dog's house needs a floor replacement and it needs to be painted. So I get it repainting. And finally, the paint in my room is a little bit old and is crumbling in places. So I will have the walls paint. And that is all. Thank you so much for watching the video. Have a nice day and goodbye.
Hi and welcome to my video. My name is Edwin Alejandro Cruz Aguilar and this is my English oral project where I'm going to talk about things that need to be fixed in my house and neighborhood. Okay, so welcome to my house. Today I'm going to show you some things in my house and neighborhood that need to be fixed. So we will start with uh, my parents' bedroom. So uh, as you can see, the roof is cracked. It just broke and fixed. So we will start with uh, my parents' bedroom. So uh, as you can see, the roof is cracked. It just broke and fell around the bed. So I really need to have the roof fixed. So in the same room, I have this uh, electrical wiring that is out of its place. So it's really dangerous. So I think I'm having it replaced tomorrow. Then, in the living room, I have these cracks in the roof because of the moisture, so it really looks bad, so I need to have it fixed. Also, in the living room, I have this uh, electrical wiring out of its place. Uh, yes, I know, I have a lot of electrical wiring out of its place, so I really need to, to have it replaced soon, because it's really dangerous. Well, let's move on to my room, where I have this uh, floorboard uh, broken, so it not only looks bad also it is dangerous so i think i need to have it replaced i also have this master switch uh, with a wire coming out of it that uh, looks really bad and it's dangerous and i don't like it so I I need to have it replaced. Let's move on outside to see what we found in the neighborhood. So this is my neighborhood and the first thing that I see are those switches. Uh, they look really bad and they look dangerous. So they are also used for vandalism. So I think they need to be be replaced by uh, something with more security or something. At the end of the street, there is a wasteland um, where people go there and throw his trash. So I think it's a very serious problem what need to be solved by the government so i think uh, it have to be replaced for a park or something there are no street lights in the street so we all need to have it fixed at the beginning of the street there is this uh, manhole without cover which is dangerous for cars so we need to have it clean it and replace it and that's all for today thank you for watching my video i hope you enjoyed it and see you later
left marks, but now I have my walls painted and I have my celly patch with one more layer of cement. Then in the bathroom, um, the sink case has broken, so I'm going to have the sink case changed for a new one. And finally, the floor, the, the floor, there is a hole has the floor is made of cement. Uh, I will get cement push and I, ha I am having uh, the whole cover. Second room, uh, I have a bathroom built, but the uh, window protectors are already wall blocking. They are very useful, useful to prevent the entry of insects. They are made, they are made of wood and mesh. Uh, so uh, I must get the same materials used and I'm going to have uh, the protector built again. And finally, uh, the room has not been used for a long time, so the walls have lost their color. And then I, I, I am having the, the walls painted soon. And that's all. Um, thanks for listening and watching the presentation. Bye. Connected because I'm going to call the roll at the end of the session. Okay, start. If you have questions, ask via chat.